The news of the presidential ambition of the former governor of Lagos State and the national leader of the All Progressive Congress, Bola Tinubu, is generating strong reactions. Residents of Gumbi recall the performance of Bola Tinubu as governor of Lagos and his political dexterity and the role that he played in the formation of the ruling APC. Others contend that it is right for the southern part of the country to produce the next president. Correspondent Larry Adeyemi has more. Residents of Gombe have been reacting to the declaration by the former governor of Lagos State and the national leader of the All Progressive Congress that he wants to become president of Nigeria. While they all agree that he is competent for the job, they have specific areas that they want him to focus on. I think it's a very welcome development. This has naturally kickstarted the process of uh, electioneering for 2023. Uh, the Jagaba of uh, Nigeria, I will not say the Jagaba of um, probably Lagos, is a Jagaba of Nigeria, is uh, an elder statesman. He has paid his dues as far as Nigerian politics is concerned. We have followed his antecedents. We know the kind of leader that he is. Uh, I, I hear people say he's a leader of leaders. Uh, he has an eye for, you know, qualitative uh, people. And, uh, you know, he has the capacity to assemble them and, 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 and unleash them. Topmost on the mind of most residents of Gombe is security. They want a commander-in-chief that would resolve the numerous security challenges across the country. While some have complete faith in his ability to deliver, others would rather adopt a wait-and-see approach. I don't know about Lagos, but people are saying he did well, people are saying he did not do well, but all we want in Nigeria is for him to do well for us. If he'll be able to at least go with us, then we'll go with him too. Talking about the challenges of this country, people like um, Tinimbu knows exactly what the issues of this country, are, this country are, and I'm sure he would uh, give his contribution to us. As Mostly the issues that are causing disunity is the issue of perception. People are perceiving as if they are marginalized. While even in the real sense, everybody is crying marginalization. So we need to take care of that perception to make sure that everyone is on board and everyone understands that, see, this is what is on the ground. And uh, there should be some sense of inclusion and belonging to every part of the country. An arrowhead of the pro-democracy struggle in the 90s, and governor of Nigeria's commercial capital, Lagos, for eight years. Ashiwaju, as his fans call him, is not new to leadership at the national level. The Jagaban, as he is also known, would have to effectively deploy all his political arsenal to form a coalition that would deliver the presidency of the most populous country in Africa. Landry Adeyemi, TVC News, Gombe.